Thanks, Christy. Well, this weekend, a qualifying round for the Billie Jean King Cup happening in Asheville. It features tennis teams from the United States and Ukraine. 7 News reporter Kelsey O'Donnell shares more on why this match extends much further than the court. Representing your country is a dream many athletes aspire to do. It's always an honor, obviously, to pay for your country. But with the ongoing Russia-Ukraine war, Ukrainian athletes say they're constantly filled with concern thinking about their families. What I can do is to, to play tournaments, to earn money, uh, to send this to my family, to help them, because nobody has a job right now there in my family. Telling us they use the court as an escape. The court is the only place right now where we don't think. Yet the moment they step off, reality sinks in. Uh, every day it's tough. It's, uh, there, is no, there is no one day that we don't think about it. Um, I talk about me. And uh, every day uh, I'm going to my parents, my family, to ask them if they are alive. And this weekend, Team USA and Ukraine will band together. We're really a true family, and we come together when things are tough. It's the Billie Jean King Cup, and while the two countries are set to compete against each other, they say they're focusing on a larger goal, uniting as one. We're opponents on the court, but we're allies and friends off the court, and we really do care for each other, and we pull together when times get tough. And a little hope to send back home is what Ukraine's team says they're working for. Our match, our tie will give our people some things to get their mind off. I mean, it's probably impossible, but at least some hope. According to the U.S. Tennis Association, 10% of the total ticket revenue from the weekend event will be donated directly to the Ukraine Crisis Relief Fund by Global Giving. In Asheville, Kelsey O'Donnell, 7 News. And the Billie Jean King Cup will take place on Friday and Saturday at the Harris Cherokee Center in Asheville.